Hail, Red Guides. DanNet is a serverless peer network, which allows all sorts of information to flow between your characters, like the buffs on your rogue, or your wizard's third target in their X-Targ window, or the direction your warrior is facing, pretty much anything you can imagine. It's an essential tool to make your group act as one, and for you to control them all from one window. There's a similar plugin named EQBC, and we have a video for that, but we're pushing folks towards DanNet as it's simpler and more powerful. The command slash DGE stands for DanNet Group Execute. And by default, it tells your immediate group to execute a command. Here, I'll tell the group I'm in to wave. Danet group execute slash wave. This works for everyone in the group except for the character who typed the command. If I want everyone in the group, including my current character, to do something, I type slash DGAE, Danet group all execute slash laugh. And now everyone, including my main, is in on the joke. To send a command to a single character, I type slash DEX, which stands for Dan at Execute, the character's name, and the command. And look at that, she gave me a buff. You can also make custom groups within DanNet. Check the description for a link with instructions. But for now, I want to show you four groups that are pre-made and ready to roll. Caster, Tank, Melee, and Priests. So for example, slash DGE, Caster, slash Wave, will make my Cloth classes Wave. Now DGE, space, Priests, say I can heal, it's going to make all my healer classes, well, say that they can heal. There's a little button on your group window called Mimic Me, and this will make your group mimic your target and your words. It's great for hailing NPCs and starting quests together. Next to that is the Follow Me button, which doesn't work if you don't have ADV path loaded, as you can see. You can type slash plugin ADV path in each window to load the plugin, but let's use a Danet command to load it on all characters all at once. Slash DGAE slash plugin ADV path. And boom, everybody's loaded. And the follow me button works. And I'm basically training myself around the zone. Now I want to go fight some big monsters. So I'm going to make a few hotkeys using default EverQuest commands. I'll drive my group from my tanks window. So I'll make the key centered around her. Uh, first, I need a key to tell my buddies to assist me. Then I need a key that tells my priests to heal me. Now a key to tell my casters to nuke the bad guy. And a key that tells my melee classes to follow the bad guy closely so they can actually, you know, do some damage. And finally a key to make everyone calm down. These are just really crude and simple keys. If you're looking for hotkeys to actually use in game, check the links in the description. And while simple, they work. I should have had my rogue stick behind the mob so then I could send her commands to backstab, but you know, this gets the job done. I'm gonna slam the nuke key here, and boom, we did it. Good job, everyone. Hooray! Up next, I'm gonna show you how to get around Norath and every other plane, moon, and planet in EverQuest. 